What's up everyone, Mega Beastly Gamer here for another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. We last left off going through this dungeon-like place, uh, rock, tu rock tunnel, and now we're about to fight whoever this guy is. Haha, -ha, can you eat my phone? Whatever. Alright, so, Hiker Dudley. <laughs> Dudley, he was a character in Harry Potter, I believe, yeah, he was... Here's an Harry Potter. Okay, uh, Geodude is his first Pokemon. And we have Mankey out, so we should be able to kill him probably one hit with Brick Break or Karate Chop. Karate Chop's got more, so let's just use that. And we took him out in one blow, just as I predicted, because I'm just that awesome. Oh yeah, Mankey is level 27. Seriously, I have no idea when he evolves. I hope he does soon. Geodude, and uh, who are we gonna use to fight Geodude? Let's just try Fira. I mean, Fira needs experience, so you might we might as well, you know? So, he's gonna send out Geodude, and I guess I'll just go for Pursuit, because it's the only one that'll do any trace of damage to- oh, Hey, that's actually pretty good, but he's gonna kill me, isn't he? Yeah, one more hit, I'm probably gonna die, so... Let's uh, send out Turbolax and hopefully kill him with like a water pulse or something. Uh, probably will, considering Turbolax is just amazing. So let's water pulse him, pulse him with our water, our pulsating water. Wow, that sounded disturbing. And this is a child-friendly channel, I think. <laughs> I don't really know, but anyway, Graveler. Uh, Let's just send out Firo just to give it some experience, like send it in, switch it out, and stuff like that. And I'm probably only going to switch out to Turbolex because he can actually take a lot of hits. So, yeah. What sucks about this situation I'm in is that uh, Cream Pie is not going to be getting any experience. So. Once we get out of Rock Tunnel, we're gonna have to train it up a lot and train basically the entire team because I guess you could say I'm under leveled for the next part of the game. Once we're in Lavender Town and all that jazz, which is oh Lavender Town's the next town here. And crap, didn't want to battle you, but oh well, I guess I have to. You're okay. Pokemaniac Cooper. Cooper's a very common name for a dog. So I guess he, I guess he's a dog then. So we got Mankey out in front. We can't use him. And I guess we'll just use Pikachu. I will be getting rid of Pikachu soon. Like I said before. Because I have a better Pokemon planned. Because I really am not a fan of Pikachu. And everyone uses Pikachu in their Let's Play. So I'm going to switch him out for something else. So just keep Thundershocking him, I guess, because I don't really have anything better. And take him down, and what will Pikachu gain? How much experience? I mean, he got 211, so 211, nice. Another Slowpoke. This time, Pikachu will be getting all the experience, because, well, Pikachu is the only one out. So let's just Thundershock it to guess. I did uh, to did the first day with my new tongue. Thundershock it to death. There we go. Phew. Well, as you might... Oh, speaking of death... Uh, not a good subject, but... Anyway, speaking of death, uh, I started a new little mini-series called Let's Play Till the First Death. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna basically play arcade or... classic games like that and stuff. And yeah. Sorry, I just had a gap in my commentary. Shouldn't have happened. Oh well. Let's just Thundershock it until it dies. And stuff like that. And it's down, so... 423. Darn it! Pikachu! Come on. You need to level up. You need to level up so you can be packed with experience and stuff. You know? Because you're going to need to get those yams. Which is an inside joke, by the way. You definitely wouldn't understand, even if I explained it. So, 
Let's switch Pikachu to the front, I guess. Or maybe Fira. Yeah, just Pikachu. Alright, I think we are at the end of the map. You can't skip- oh, you can skip him. Didn't think you could- wow! I'll probably go back in there soon and face them again. And face them, not again, but just face them. So I got a pearl, I could sell that. I wonder if I have anything else I can sell. I got Stardust and a pearl. Uh, what do we have? Right, need to use a repel. And... Let's go fight this chick. And right down to the southwest is the exit to the dungeon. So, uh, once we battle her and hopefully beat her, I'm pretty sure she just has a really crappy team. So yeah, once we beat her, we'll be able to leave the dungeon, and we should be set. Let's mega punch it and kill it. Oh, darn it, you didn't die. Come on, Pikachu. How does a growl get you that intimidated and stuff? Just kill him. There we go. Meowth's dead. And we level up. Nice. Pikachu, level up. Oh, and it just learned Thunder. Yeah, sure, whatever. Let's, uh, get rid of Thunder... I might need Thunder Wave, so let's just get rid of Thunder Shock. And poof! Thunder Shock. Yeah, Thunderbolt. Woo! Thunderbolt is, like, the only move that Ash ever uses with his Pikachu. Which kind of gets annoying after a while, you know? Because, like, he's like, oh, Pikachu! Thunderbolt! 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 And then... Ten minutes into the movie, into the show, he's like, Oh, Pikachu, use Thunderbolt again! Oh, yeah, Thunderbolt. And it gets kind of annoying. Kind of like me saying Thunderbolt over and over. It gets kind of annoying. Come on, kill the Pidgey. There we go. That's what I call power. The powerhouse. And she's going to send out an Oddish, so I will not switch out, because Firo is pretty good fighting grass types considering it's a flying type. So let's just heck it. So there we go. Oddish is down and we'll probably not get any experience really. Oh! Nice. Not bad. Not the worst. But not the best. So let's head over here and leave Rock Tunnel. We're on to Route 10, so I'm just gonna pick up this berry, the Nanab berry. Oh ha, Nanab the knob, knob for life. So here we are, Lavender Town. It's got some creepy music. I just can't hear it right now, oh, that's weird. Anyway, let's go into the Pokemon Center, and Repel's Effect wore off, hooray. And let's heal up. Da 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 da. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're going to go switch me out of my party and replace it with cream pie. Bills VC, move, and cream pie. There we go. Switch Meowth. There we have it. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. My party of six. So, who's up front? Is Pikachu still up front? I think Pikachu is still up front. So, hold on, let me... Let me check Cream Pie's summary real quick, see how much experience it has. Alright, I guess I'll just level up Firo first. G darn it, because it's going to take less time, so... Just get that out of the way and then work on Cream Pie. So we're going to go left, because we really have nothing we can do in Lavender Town right now. So we'll head over here, I guess battle this guy, whatever. Okay, uh, he's a gam good I was about to say gambler. But whatever, Gamer Rich. I guess they called him Gamer because gambling's not good for the children, it's a bad influence. Yeah, stuff like that. So let's peck it to death, hopefully kill it pretty fast. Uh, I guess peck's not gonna do anything, so... Let's go with Fury Attack. And hopefully kill it. Two, three, four, five, and Growlithe is dead. 
Firo, you are amazing. I have to say, you are an awesome Pokemon. And you're level 26! Ooh, a Vulpix. Uh... I guess Turbolax will have to go out, because Cream Pie really can't handle a, a uh, fire type. Vulpix, Vulpix, Vulpix. Speaking of Vulpix, um... I'm planning on doing a, another Pokemon Let's Play, which will involve a Vulpix. That's the only thing I'm telling you. I will not tell you which game it is, but... I will tell you which Pokemon it is. It is Vulpix that I will use, at one point or another. So it's super effective, and we kill it. One blow, I think that was. One blow. <laughs> Darn it! Shouldn't be talking like that. It's a child-friendly channel, you know what I'm saying? Aw, oh, crap. I should have kept me off on here. Oh, well. Let's just skip over some of these people. Hopefully, yep, skipped over the biker. Because I do not want to battle anybody. And let's hopefully... There we go. We don't have to deal with that guy. So we're going to go into the underground path and run all the way to the left. So we can go into Celadon City. Which is a pretty cool city. The gym leader is all grass type. And... I will not be challenging the gym leader this episode because, well, I don't feel like challenging the gym leader, plus I don't have any time to do it. So let's go up here, over here, over here, back here, up here, up here, up here, down here, slowly but surely, then into the miniature Pokemon Academy. Pick up the Eevee. Now let's give a nickname to Eevee. Ah, perfect. It's a boy. So I will call it after my after a fellow Let's Player. Uh, uh yeah. After a fellow Let's Player, don't never talk to him, but he is my uh my inspiration. Blink. There we go. Like, Blink and You Miss It. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you've all heard of him. Blink and You Miss It was the inspiration for my Let's Plays, but Munching Orange is another influence on what I'm doing right now. Munching Orange is who inspired me to do Pokemon, of all games. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go into the Pokemon Center, uh, switch out my Pikachu, and then heal up. And that would probably be it this time. So let's just do that. Oops. Move Pokemon. Blink. And get rid of Pikachu, and... Well, like I said, that'll be it for this time, and I will see you guys later.